Okay. Just focus. Go ahead. Ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'll start with the nervous system. So here we have the supraesophageal ganglion, and here's the subesophageal ganglion. Leads into the ventral nerve cord, and each of these enlarged bundles along the ventral nerve cord is the ventral nerve ganglion. Um, digestive system is gray on the model, so the mouth leads to the esophagus, esophagus to the crop. Uh, right here are the gastric cecum that release digestive enzymes into the stomach. Behind that is the gizzard. Gizzard leads to the stomach, stomach to the intestine, intestine to the rectum, and then the anus. Okay, we have um, nine hearts, which are enlarged sections of the dorsal blood vessel that you see going to the anterior section. The respiratory system is formed by this dorsal tracheal trunk that leads into tracheal branches. Uh, this is an air sac here. Each of the tracheal branches ends in a spiracle uh, that comes through the exoskeleton. Uh, what else? This green thing here is the salivary gland, it secretes saliva into the mouth. Uh, these brown squiggly things are the malpighian tubules, part of the excretory system. And then this is a female grasshopper, so you have uh, eggs in the egg tube. Uh, egg tube leads to the vagina. The opening of that is the ovipositor. That's it. Good. Okay, so this is an insect, so there are three body regions. You have the head, thorax, and abdomen. Uh, the head has a pair of antennae, compound eyes, and three ocelli. Uh, the thorax is where the appendages are attached, so there are three pairs of legs that are removed on the model. You also have the wings attached to the thorax, so you have a forewing and a hindwing. This part of the thorax, uh, very protective, shield-shaped part of the thorax is the pronotum. Um, also on the thorax you have the tympanum, which is an external eardrum. Uh, the segmented area is the abdomen. Each of those segments has a spiracle for uh, respiration. Uh, and this is a female grasshopper, you can tell because the posterior end is forked. That's it. Okay, so we'll start with the digestive system. So this is the esophagus here that leads to the cardiac stomach. Inside the cardiac stomach are chitinous teeth called the gastric mill. That leads to the pyloric stomach. From there, it goes to the intestine. Intestine all the way down here to the anus. Uh, this is the heart here, leading to the dorsal blood vessel that lies right atop the intestine. Uh, down here is the digestive gland that secretes enzymes into the stomachs. Uh, just uh, underneath the heart you find the gonads. And then the nervous system, you have the supraesophageal ganglion up here. Down here is the subesophageal ganglion, leading into the ventral nerve cord with ventral nerve ganglion uh, bundles along its length. Uh, up here at the base of the antenna you have the, the green gland that ends in an excretory pore that releases urine at the base of the antenna.